Say, have you guys ever had uh, issues with your carpet taking way too long to dry uh, after you cleaned it? Well, you know, that's a kind of a common, a common occurrence, that and you having your spots uh, wicking back up on you. Hi, I'm Steve Hansen, go founder of the janitorialstore.com. Uh, we had a member uh, write us a question about that. They were a little concerned. You know, they applied their pre-spray with the pump-up sprayer, which is fine. That's what I recommend, rather than putting it into your uh, solution tank. Uh, you know, they had their PSI set at uh, 300, which is, uh, again, that's, that's a good setting. And, uh, but uh, they think where they went wrong on this is that uh, they made one wet pass and two dry passes. But they're saying that their first pass on their wet pass, they moved kind of slow with the wand. And uh, that's something you got to think about because when you have 300 PSI, you're putting down a lot of water. So keep that in mind when you're uh, doing your, your wet pass at 300 PSI, uh, adjust that, that speed of the wand to the soil of the carpet. So what I mean by that, if it's more heavily soiled, maybe what you're going to do is you're going to do a double pass or even a chop stroke. But if it's reason, you know, if it's pretty lightly soiled, then just do a single pass, single, single wet pass, single dry pass, or double dry pass. Even uh, you know, the more vacuum passes, the better. Less chance of uh, things uh, taking way too long to dry. So I think that's what had happened with you, with uh, your situation there. Uh, the other thing I think I'd probably check on your machine is make sure that the vacuum is working properly. Uh, you should be recovering uh, a, a large percentage of that water through your vacuum. So check that out. Make sure the vacuum hoses aren't clogged or anything like that. And uh, you know that's the reason also for your spots uh, coming back on you uh, because it's taking way too long to dry. So everything's wicking to the top. Uh, the thing you want to do there is obviously you want to get it to dry faster. So you know, take a look at the, your your uh, your uh, wand stroke and uh, also make an extra pass. And you know, in some cases, what I've done is I've actually followed followed up with a with a a bonnet, a bonnet, either uh, a cotton bonnet or a microfiber bonnet to help pull more moisture and soil out of that carpet. Then I always turn on all exhaust fans in the area, and I'll even then I got my carpet fans sitting in various positions to help dry that carpet quickly. So uh, try some of those tips, and I think you're going to have better luck with that. So uh, hopefully this will help. Until next time, uh, let's keep it clean.